Hello everybody, my name is Eric, and welcome to Destiny 2. Now, uh, big updates, Guardian Games. Uh, as a D2 veteran, I played this game for a long time, it's really hype to hear that there's a new vehicle. And with that, there's a lot of vehicle techs that come with it. So, we got the new hoverboard. Everyone knows what this does. Uh, you got your right click, and it's cool that you can glide. By the way, there's a new glitch going on. Uh, basically, make sure you have... Uh, where is it? Uh, make sure you have crouch on toggle. It actually doesn't work with uh, hold right now. Uh, it just won't work. You, you're gonna try to click control and it just won't work. Make sure you have it on toggle, which is kind of annoying. And then you can glide basically uh, infinitely on this hoverboard thingy mobilover. What makes this better than the ship is that when you right click boost or dodge left and right by double tapping A and D, uh, you don't actually consume energy. The only thing that consumes energy is the jump, which is new to everyone, and this new uh, skate on thin air thing, like Tony Hawk style. Everything is really good. Um, quick recap on how to get it. You just do Guardian Games, uh, load up the game, go to the tower, talk to some old lady in the center that's really popular, uh, eventually do a small little quest that's really easy to do. You'll eventually get the uh, the gray version, which is actually temporary. You'll actually It'll actually disappear from inventory at the end of this event. So to get the permanent exotic version, you'll eventually get a really hard quest Something like uh, dunk a bajillion medallions in the Gardens game event or something, or get top 10%. The easier part is actually do top 10%. All you need to do is play um, the competitive uh, Nightfall. I'd say do it solo or do it with a team you can communicate with. There's a really good cheese where all you do is before every single orange bar, a uh, yellow bar or mini boss or champion, all you need to do is emote, any emote. Uh, in front of that mob, not invisible or anything, make sure it pops in the bottom of the chat. Emo, and then do a finisher. You'll get something called insult the, uh, insult the injury. And you'll instantly, if you do that for every single orange bar, uh, yellow bar, champion, whatever, uh, you will get top 10% easily. And uh, yeah, you can even do a solo. Not even finish the entire thing. Run out of time and you'll still get top 10% and get the exotic. So that's how you get it. Everyone knows the basics that I already talked about. A lot of glitches are going on, people crashing their games. Like I said, the, the toggle thing doesn't work. But what really hyped me is that uh, there's been some uh, crazy techs. Here's the tech, number one. You can actually speed this up. Notice that this is slow as fuck. It's fast, but it's actually slower than the normal just right click boost. However, you can get on par with the speed by doing a little tech where once you're in the glide, you want to look either left or right. I'm going to choose left. Hold down D, which will keep you uh, look, keep you propel keep you moving to the right. Then you want to unglide, double tap D, which will dodge you to the right, and then reglide. So what you're going to be doing is you're going to be in the glide, looking left while moving to the right, unglide, dodge right, glide again, and it's going to look like this. I know that was a mouthful, but. It'll make more sense when you see it. So, you wanna glide, look to the left, while moving to the right like this. Uh, control D, control. Like, just that simple. Unglide, dodge to the right, glide again, and do this really fast. And what you're actually gonna see is that you're going mock speeds. If you do it really, really fast, you lose no speed at all. There we go, I lost some speed right there. But if you do it really fast, you lose no speed, and you actually gain speed. You do lose a little bit of height if you do it slow. So get really good at this. This part's easy. This is how you speed yourself up back to uh, normal speeds, actually pretty fast speeds. Uh, there's a second tap. You might notice that if you're on uh, the sparrow, or not the sparrow, the skimmer, that if you're in the air or gliding or whatever, no matter how you spam the space bar, no matter what you do, you're stuck midair, glued to it, to your demise, you're gonna fall 5 billion miles uh, down, and then uh, probably crash and die. There's actually a way to kind of glitch it out. I don't think it's a glitch, but it's an extremely hard tech. What you need to be doing is not be in the glide animation. So basically shift, click the shift key to jump in the air, or just get out of the glide animation somehow. Either be falling or in the jump animation. You want to dodge, re-glide, and then space bar. Extremely flippin' fast. If you do it fast enough, I've only done this like three times. Apparently some guy on controller can do it like consistently. I can't, even though I've been playing this this fucking game for so damn long. Basically you wanna jump, double tap right click, control, and then spacebar. Mid-air. So let me see if I can try to do this 
but I probably can't because I've been trying for the past half hour and only got it to work like three times. So, get in your glide, do your cool strat, uh, the cool like dodge technique to speed yourself up. Once you find yourself running low on energy in the bottom left, or you just want to get off the thing mid-air, you want to jump in the air, dodge right click, uh, glide again, and then space. If you do it fast enough, you won't end up in the glide again, and you'll actually just get off the uh, skimmer. I can't do it, but here's a clip. Maybe I'll show it uh, of the original guy who found this quite literally like a couple hours ago on how he did it. Now, with all these in mind, you can do some crazy shit. Like, you can use uh, the OG technique of Shatter Dive. You go this far, this far, and then once you're running low, you can activate this, do this technique. And you actually see that you can actually reach all the way over there. I ran out of energy, which sucks balls, but if I did it better, or if I could consistently get off of it midair, which I believe you guys can do, and a lot of sluts can do it already, I can't do it because I suck, I'd say I'd compare it to the difficulty of Titan bubble skating. It's that, you have like one frame to do it. I pulled it off a couple times, probably can't do it in this video, but that's the extent of the guy. To my knowledge, that's all the ticks there are in this. So a quick recap, this is the new hoverboard, you can get it with uh, the, the way I mentioned before. It's better than the Sparrow because it's the same speed, however you can boost right click and dodge left and right infinitely because it uses no charge. The only thing that uses charge is the jump, which is insane because you can keep jump, gliding, jump, glide, and keep getting height like that. That's the only way you use uh, energy. And it doesn't even use that much, to be honest. Glide's overpowered. There's some glitches with the glide that I already talked about. Just put it on a uh, toggle crouch instead if you're on. You can uh, fix the delay in speed or uh, the lowered amount of speed in the glide by using the dodge technique. By simply looking left while holding D to go to the right like this. Unglide, double tap, dodge, reglide. Do that really fast and then go back to holding D like that. And you'll actually add speed. I suck at it because uh, it's kind of a new tech. I need more practice on this stuff. And if you find yourself running low on energy, you can do that insane technique. It's literally like one frame. You're basically doing it on the same thing. Get out, all you need to do is get out of the glide animation, either by just ungliding like this, or get out of the glide animation with a jump. And after the jump, you want to dodge, re-glide, jump. After the shift jump, you want to dodge, re-glide, space bar. Insanely hard. I can't get it here. I don't know. Go search up uh, the original guy. I'll put it in the um, in the description of this video. Uh, yeah, if you want to see more Destiny content, I don't know. Comment below and I'll make some more. Subscribe and see you in the next video. Probably new guides. Bye-bye.